For this part, we're going to start by setting up um, a sterile zone to work in. So first off, we're going to take some freshly made disinfectant. Uh, so this is Vircon, a multi-oxidizer um, to use. And we're going to mop down uh, the area that we're going to be working in. So the tissue that I'm using here will be put in an autoclave bag for disposal. Next we bring in a Bunsen burner and this will be hooked up to the gas supply and one slip. This will create an updraft. So hot air rising, if you put it on a full strength blue flame will be enough to make sure that microbes rise up and away from your experiment rather than into it causing contamination. So in this area that we've created, we will have a sterile zone roughly this size, um, in which it's okay to open lids on bottles and dishes without risking contamination. The only thing that should be now brought into this work zone is materials that you're going to use for your work. Uh, you don't want to be over-clustering the area in case of accidents, but also because there's sources of contamination.